I have no idea why I haven't seen anybody cover this weapon yet. The thing is an utter beast. Oh, and it looks pretty too. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and today I'll bring you another BR3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out and subscribe if you do want to see more. So today guys, we are taking a look at an epic shotgun called the Firecracker. And this is rewarded for a side mission called Happily Ever After, which appears at the lodge once you complete the campaign. This firecracker shotgun is the reward for this side mission. So looking at this weapon people, we can see it's quite a powerhouse, dealing 1674 times 12 at a level 57. That's a total possible damage output per shot of 20,088 per 2 ammo consumed. Like wow. Now I'm sure this weapon is set in stone and it only comes in this variant. I hope I am wrong as I'd love this thing anointed, but I don't think I am. So this Hyperion Incendiary Shotgun as you can see is quite the brute on paper and guys in reality it's how it performs out in the field too. Testing this against the test dome it does a heck more damage over the standard anarchy with no stacks, nothing less than even the protuberance. So that there should tell you just how beastly this thing is. I can see this now within many builds out there, far beyond what I can currently achieve with my current build for sure. Now weapons like this and quest reward weapons are 9 times out of 10 gimmicky weapons, ones you use for about 5 minutes then stash inside your bank or put on your wall. This one though in reality isn't much different gimmicky wise, because it shoots fireworks, check this out. Now how cool is that? But after using this weapon I can tell you people it's an utter monster. Yes it may be gimmicky, but it's still a beast. I used this and was loving it guys, but I will say not in every scenario. From any kind of range your hopes in hitting all of these exploding fireworks are kind of minimal, but if you get close enough they do incredible damage as you would expect. So this side quest mission reward gimmicky weapon is in fact an absolute beast and it makes easy work within many scenarios this game throws at you. It's great with add control due to the spread of those firework projectiles but it's also amazing against those larger bosses and larger single target enemies as the spread of those fireworks do get to work indeed. So here we have people an epic weapon, a one off epic weapon which performs a lot better than many of the new DLC legendaries. Which really guys, we shouldn't be really surprised about. In my opinion still to this day many people sleep on these epic weapons, so I believe Gearbox purposely hide gems amongst them, and this is one of those. So yes people, this firecracker is an absolute animal of a shotgun one I do recommend you get in and try it out, and if it looks interesting to you, you know how to get it. But on that note guys we have come to the end of the video, if you guys enjoyed it leaving a like it really helps out, if you are new around here and want to see more Borderlands be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video or upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys thanks as always for stopping by, hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.